Hey, it's Todd Burrier from ToddBurrier.com, and today I'm going to give you a little social media tip. Um, you know, there are so many incredible opportunities with social media. I mean, there are, there are people that build their entire business that way. Um, I'm, I'm more offline and a little online, um, but, you know, there's many, many things you can do today, right? And so you have all these great opportunities. So I'm just going to give you one little tip uh, for social media uh, that is kind of right in an area where I see people make lots of mistakes. So I felt a, a need kind of to share it with you. So first, what not to do in general is don't splash your product or your service or your company name all over your page. That's not going to help you. It, I, I know some, some people think that, you know, when they do that, that people are going to go, oh, great, I'm going to join, I'm going to buy. That, that's not what happens. People don't go to social media to buy. That's not why they're there. They do buy from social media, but that's not why they go. And so they go because they're interested in things, right? And, and, and it's for the community and so that they can be involved. There's all kinds of reasons they go, but buying is not the purpose. So here's, here's a really simple thing you can do. Post a result that you're happy about, depending on what it is that you're doing. And I'll give you a goofy example. Let's say you bought a new pair of jeans. You've been looking for a pair of jeans to fit you just right, you know, because sometimes it's hard to find a pair of jeans to fit you just right. And everybody can relate to that. And so, so you find a pair of jeans that fits you just right and you, you're excited about it. So you post on your page, man, I finally found a pair of jeans that fit me perfectly. They are so awesome. And that's it. And what do you think is going to happen among your social media friends who also are interested in blue jeans? right, or finding a pair of blue jeans, you're going to start getting questions. Hey, hey, what kind did you get? Or where did you get them? Or what? Right? That's what would naturally happen. I know it's a goofy example. But there's merit to that because you want to post in a way that's not selling. See, that was a that was a post about your enthusiasm about your blue jeans. You weren't posting to say, hey, private message, man, I'll tell you all about my blue jeans, right? That's not what that then you'd start to be moving into a way where people go, why should I private? Why do you want me to private message you about your blue jeans? And so you want to post in a way that is not selling, right? So let's say you've, you're in, in a weight loss business, for example, and you've lost nine pounds in 10 days, right? Or two weeks or whatever. You could simply post something like, I am so excited. I've lost nine pounds. It's awesome. That's it. That, that's it. Or maybe it's skincare. I finally got my skin to clear up. I'm so excited. It's just a simple thing, right? But what does it do? Is it makes someone else who might be interested in finding or struggling with weight or struggling with skin, and we could use a bazillion examples, right? Anything related to what you're doing. Um, they're going to reach out, right? Not everybody, right? You can't expect to post something and 500 people go, okay, tell me what it is, right? But that's, hey, this is a marathon, right? And so that kind of post and you can be more clever than that, but that what I just gave you would work, right? It doesn't have a call to action in it, right? There's no other thing in it that makes someone go, why'd you post that? It's just a normal thing to express your enthusiasm about something. And so that will get some people to go, hey, what did you do? Or what are you doing, right? And so then you can say, hey, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll PM you. Or, or you can just private message them and take it from there and take the conversation offline. So that is a really simple tip that will help you, right? It's it's that kind of thing because you it, that's I mean you could do other things, right? There are other posting big long stories. There's a million ways to to do it. But that's one little simple tip that is effective in uh, creating curiosity and having people reach out to you. So, I hope you found that helpful for today.